This is a total joke, don't take this game serious. Oh, really? Oh, I thought this was gonna be a serious game. It's called SpongeGTA.exe and it wants to access my fireball. <laughs> Hello everyone, my name is Kyuzek and welcome to Itch.io Trash Pile, my brand new series where I will plunder through Itch.io for some diamonds in the rough. And boy do we have a hard lineup for today. I have downloaded 50 games from Itch.io, so let's hope that at least one of them works. Now based on the screenshots alone I can tell that some of these games are potential bangers, but I've also downloaded about 49 games that are not gonna be shit. So strap your seatbelts, activate your antivirus and prepare your minds, for we are about to ask the age old question, will these games even launch? Let's find out. Okay, so first off we have Annihilation, zombie mod. Now at the bottom there's a warning entirely in thigh, and the install instructions say that I first must donate, so uh... Is this ransomware? Okay, I have just finished downloading it and it's a 1GB EXE file. They couldn't have made this any more fishy if they fucking tried. Do you want to allow this app for an unknown publisher to make changes for your device? Yes, absolutely. Yo, no- There's no way this guy put his fucking YouTube channel in- Oh man, this guy is a legend. Oh man, look at this! You didn't tell me Bethesda was making this game! <laughs> oh my god, look at this reload speed! We're waiting! I mean, it's realistic, I gotta give them that, but like, it, it, it kinda makes the gun unusable, you know? Look at this fucking Nerf pistol! I am literally blowing their brains out and they are not doing anything! Okay, now, the round ended, but nothing is happening anymore, so I... I guess this was the end of it? Next game! If I can figure out how to close this game... Ah, task manager! Where would I be without you? Alright, next up we are playing EDP445 Simulator. This game was made as a part time of a week long game jam with my professor. How would you go and explain this game to your professor? I, I swear to god if this is just like a Slenderman clone. Okay, objective. Find a cupcake. <laughs> I hope you guys can see something because I sure as fuck cannot. Oh, yes, a cupcake. How do I pick it up? Did you miss me? I gotta collect 10 of them. I like how the developers couldn't be asked to put some actual textures in the game, so they just made it black and white. We tired of playing with your ass, nigga! Uh, come on, EDP! Show yourself! Ah! It's following me! I don't know how to run, but I know it's up my ass because I can see it! Oh, you can save in this game? Oh, you should have told me immediately. Okay, now please tell me that the cupcakes didn't, like, reset. They didn't. Good. Okay. Once here... Did you miss me? Oh, no! <laughs> this fucking god. Like, there, there's no way to avoid him. Like, once he finds you, you're fucked. So I just gotta memorize where he will spawn after every single cupcake, and I will be fine. I got one here. <laughs> okay, this game isn't fun anymore. This game isn't fun anymore. Like, <laughs> guys, I think I broke the game. The load game button is just stuck here. That's what you get for saves coming, I guess. Well, I think this is about enough EDP 445 simulator. I didn't want to play it anyways. <laughs> Next game. Next up, Garfield 3. Prepare for war. Garfield and his minions are after the precious lasagna in the fridge. Place furniture in their way to stop them in this plants vs zombies clone. Okay, cool. Let's download it. Also, we are gonna download this cat. Yo, there is no way. All of the image files and sound files are here just like free to be edited. Do you guys know what this means? First off, we are gonna make this cat look like Garfield. There we go, perfect. Look at this cute motherfucker. Okay, let's start the game. Lasagna. What is that sound? Guys, please excuse me for a while. I need to I need to install Audacity. A few minutes later. Hello, my name is Garfield. Please open the fridge. I want your lasagna. And then we're gonna use some effects to make it like as demonic as possible. <laughs> Hello, my name is Garfield. Please open the fridge. I want your lasagna. This sounds just like Garfield. Yes. What is this file? Okay, now this is way too demonic for a family-friendly kids channel. Hey yo, Johnny boy, let's play! There we go. Guys, are you ready for the game experience of your life? Okay, let's barricade this shit. I'm kinda worried because the cats haven't shown up. Hello, my name is Carl. <laughs> Carl, you have to open the fridge. He's not Hello, even playing all the way through. Hello, You're never getting my fridge. Hey yo, Johnny boy, let's play! <laughs> I, I thought the little cat was supposed to be Garfield, but it wasn't for like copyright reasons or whatever. <laughs> hey yo, Johnny boy, let's play. <laughs> it, it just fucking died instantly. Hello, Get away, hello. you demonic Garfields. Hello. No. I like how the game crashes if you fail, so failure is not an option. <laughs> so next up, we are continuing on with the Garfield theme. We are playing Garfield's Adventure. Nine to kill big shrimp guy, touch any other enemy to kill them. And when you're done, touch the white door behind the shrimp for more. That is the entire description for this game. I, I can't fucking deal with this. 
There's that one guy from that one cartoon just passing out and it's just playing like the most icy theme song. I can't wait for Walt Disney to personally rise up from his fucking grave to show up at my door and hang me by my testicles and give me like a DMCA claim. Like the number 9 isn't even doing anything. The only control for this game was number 9 and it's not doing shit. So how do I escape? The door? Is that fucking Spongebob? I like how they shamelessly just read Pokemon textures for this. I love how I'm not even touching my controls and this could pass for a modern shit post. I would start the next game, but uh, the escape key does nothing. <laughs> I am fucked. Next up, we are gonna play Red Terror, the Shrek, in what badly seems like to be a Slender clone. You are a simple man that is driving home when you lose all of your gas and have to find a way home. Try to survive Red Shrek and get all the onions. So I assume test2.exe is the game. This is already looking great. This is already looking great. <laughs> ah, made with Unity, the indie game seal of approval. Oh boy. Why does this car look like it's from South Park? <laughs> okay, so uh, let's go find some onions, shall we? Nothing like eating an onion straight from the ground. Hello. Wait a minute. These aren't real cocks at all. They're not even moving. That means they're imposters. That's kind of sus, you know? Uh, so when they said Red Shrek, they literally mean Shrek that is red. Okay, cool. Let's go. <laughs> no, no, no. I refuse to play this game. Next up, we got the... Uh, Sponge Glock Square Pants. I like the commenters helping each other out in the comment section. Crashes whenever I try to run this game after it installs. Your PC is just bad. <laughs> I like the icon, it's just a fucking pineapple with a gun on it. Also, this game apparently only runs in 720p, so uh, excuse me while I stretch my screen. Okay, Gary, I'm sorry, I don't have enough money to feed you anymore. I must shoot you right between the eyes so you die as fast as you can. So I can't kill my own pet snail, but like, can I kill civilians? <laughs> Okay, Mr. Krabs, are you here? This is what you get for not giving me a pay raise. Die, you stingy piece of shit. <laughs> oh, I was supposed to press E to talk. I, I think it's kind of late now. Uh, can I restart this game? Okay, Mr. Krabs, I have come to renegotiate my pay raise. Army boy, you know what day it is? Debt collecting day. I've got a list of people I need you to have a chat with. <laughs> Go to Squidward's house and collect the overdue ketamine debt. Squidward, me boy, I got bad news for you. Soon after. Uh oh. SpongeBob, you don't have to do this. <laughs> Jesus fucking god. Why does this play like a Vice City cutscene? <laughs> New objective go to Patrick's house to collect the overdue drug money. I'm just gonna kill everyone in Bikini Bottom, am I? Hey, careful where you point that thing. You wouldn't wanna accidentally kill your best friend, would you? <laughs> I like how his screens were just completely muffled by this cheery music. <laughs> so, to round off today's video, we are playing The Krusty Cartel. <laughs> This is a total joke, don't take this game serious. Oh, really? Oh, I thought this was gonna be a serious game. It's called spongegta.exe and it wants to access my firewall. <laughs> okay, if I can give any feedback, the shadows remind me of like a 2004 video game magazine renders. <laughs> hey Spongebob, I tied up some hostages to a bunch of bombs at the boot. <laughs> oh, 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 Squidward. Howdy partner, some kids are trying to cancel me for <laughs> saying the N-word. Kill them in cold blood. If you don't, I can't make any more ketamine for Mr. Krabs. You know, I don't know who she meant by kids, but uh, all I'm seeing is the same fucking tea posing fish everywhere. Like, <laughs> bro, whoever made this game, I, I know it's a joke game, but they didn't even fucking try. <laughs> this is like cyberpunk PS4 level shit. Okay, so that was spongegta.exe. Uh, never again. <laughs> So yeah, I think that's about enough Unity games for today. <laughs> but anyways, I thank you all for watching. Your support is always appreciated. And I'll be back next week with something else. I think I missed a PlayStation episode last week, so I'm gonna do that. Once again, thank you and bye for now.